Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to be looking at the anat anatomy of the carotid sheath. What is the carotid sheath? Well, it's basically an anatomical term for fibrous connective tissue that surrounds the vascular compartments of the neck. It's composed of a deep cervical fascia of the neck just below the superficial cervical fascia. We are also going to provide you with a mnemonic towards the end that will allow you to remember and recall the contents of the carotid sheath. The deep cervical fascia of the neck includes basically four parts. It consists of the investing layer, the carotid sheath, the pretracheal fascia, and the pre-vertebral fascia, and we're going to be looking at the carotid sheath in detail today. The carotid sheath is basically a condensation of deep fascia in which are embedded the common and the internal carotid arteries, the internal jugular vein, and the vagus nerve. It also consists of the deep cervical group of lymph nodes forming a chain along the internal jugular vein and are also embedded in the carotid sheath as well. The carotid sheath basically blends in front with the pretracheal and the investing layers of deep fascia and behind with the pre-vertebral layer of deep fascia. So why is the carotid sheath so important? Well, basically it consists of some major structures contained within the carotid sheath. And as we've mentioned before, this includes the common carotid artery, parts of the internal carotid artery and the external carotid artery. It consists of the internal jugular vein, the vagus nerve, the recurrent laryngeal nerve, and also the deep cervical lymph nodes. What is the significance of the carotid sheath? Well, the carotid sheath may act as a conduit for infections. So what are the contents of the carotid sheath and how can you remember? Well, if you remember a mnemonic called having, having, H-A-V-I-N-G, H equals the hypoglossal nerve, A equals the accessory nerve, V equals the vagus nerve. So just, just to reiterate, in the upper part of the carotid sheath, uh, this contains the glossopharyngeal nerve, the accessory nerve, and the hypoglossal nerve. H equals hypoglossal nerve, A equals accessory nerve, V equals vagus nerve, I equals internal carotid artery and the internal jugular vein, N is nodes that includes the cervical chain C1, C2 and C3, and G equals the glossopharyngeal nerve. So if you remember having, you will never forget the contents of the carotid sheath. Hope you've enjoyed the presentation. Hope you've enjoyed the video. If you've found it beneficial, please kindly, please kindly subscribe and like. It really helps the channel progress further. Thank you very much indeed.